Tonight I'm going to clean the uh, engine compartment in my 2004 Mustang and these are the products I'm going to use. Uh, purple Power Concentrated Degreaser, uh, a paintbrush, an old paintbrush, uh, microfiber towels, some aluminum foil, and some silk shine dressing by Chemical Guys, and a power washer. And this is the engine uh, compartment. It's uh, it's pretty dirty, so uh, I'm going to clean it. Make it look like new again. Let's start by taking a old grocery bag and covering the alternator. Keep water out of there. And I'm going to put aluminum foil on any uh, electrical. Um, connections that looks like uh, water could go down into the terminals. Just put it on there and, and it forms. I like using aluminum foil because it just kind of forms around the electrical connection and that will help keep the water out of there. Also, I'm putting a uh, plastic grocery bag into the uh, where the air filter is at to try and keep water out of there as much as possible so I don't get my air filter all wet. Now I'm going to spray it. I put the degreaser in a uh, spray bottle and I'm going to uh, spray the engine compartment down real good with the degreaser. spraying down into the, the front part of the engine now so there's some pretty heavy grease down there and put it on quite liberally don't be shy with it So now it's all sprayed down. You let it set for about five minutes and then take your old paintbrush so you can scrub around on any uh, grease that's on there and so you can loosen it up. Scrub around any parts that uh, you can see that's got dirt and grease on it. Loosen it up. I'm going to take the power washer and I have it on the uh, fan setting and uh, spraying down the front of the engine where the grease is pretty thick making sure that I get that sprayed off and uh, I try to uh, be as careful as I can to not spray directly on any uh, electrical boxes um, to try and keep water out of them uh, they're pretty protected because uh, some of the electric connections uh, like the uh, fuse box is uh, completely encased in plastic, but uh, still want to be kind of careful that you don't jet water into that uh, case. And take your microfiber towels and uh, just start wiping the engine down. Take your foil off your electrical connections. Take the plastic off your alternator. And then you're going to use your silk dressing and uh, spray that all over the engine compartment.
pretty liberal with it. I like this dressing because it's not, uh, it doesn't leave a sticky residue and uh, so it, it's uh, less likely to uh, collect dust. There's other dressings you can get at the auto parts store too. You don't have to use this kind, but I just like the, like this one personally. You also can use this uh, dressing on your upholstery inside your car. Just wipe it down with a microfiber towel after you uh, use your dressing. Getting down into the nooks and crannies. This is the uh, uh, wipe down uh, inside the uh, engine compartment, the metal uh, part of it. Now it's all done. This is a shot during the day, and it looks like new. I'm going to kind of pan around over to the uh, driver's side of the vehicle so we can take a look at it. Pretty good, came out good. I like a nice clean engine. I like a clean car, but I also like the com engine compartment to look clean. It also helps when you're working on it, you don't get so much grease on your hands. There's the passenger side. Came out good. Hope this helps.